Hey guys, Ethan Lane from Microchip Technology here. In this video, I will discuss various ways to reduce power consumption in embedded systems with the PIC-18 F56Q71 family of microcontrollers. When designing any type of application, power consumption is a critical factor to consider. In embedded systems such as wireless sensors, automotive, household appliances, and medical devices, power consumption can be a major design constraint. It can be difficult to design any embedded system when all these power consumption factors are taken into consideration. For example, wearable devices, wireless sensors, and other systems that utilize battery power must minimize power consumption to maximize the system's life. Many applications are usually part of a larger system, which often means that power needs to be budgeted on a component by component basis to maximize the system's life. A key step in developing your embedded system is to implement the right design strategy such as selecting the right set of peripherals to be used in the microcontroller. Due to the widespread use of microcontrollers in portable and space constrained applications, low power is an essential design aspect, so choosing the right microcontroller to incorporate into your design is a key factor. Now, let's explore some of the ways the PIC-18 F56Q71 family of microcontrollers can help reduce overall power consumption in your embedded design. The Analog Peripheral Manager is a new feature included on the Q71 that helps reduce overall power consumption by allowing analog peripherals to be automatically turned on and turned off with a special timer. This peripheral is ideal for low power applications that use analog sensors that require periodic measurement rather than sensors that need continuous monitoring. Using the Analog Peripheral Manager, users can activate or deactivate analog peripherals without waking up the CPU. As a result, decreasing the application's overall power consumption. The PIC-18 F56Q71 is equipped with a wide variety of coin-dependent peripherals, which are on-chip dedicated blocks of hardware that operate independently of the CPU. This allows your design to operate in low power modes, thereby reducing the overall power consumption of your design. Analog peripherals such as the analog to digital converter with computation and context switching Enable us to interface with multiple sensor nodes while reducing power consumption by automating some operations that the CPU would normally perform. For example, the Q71's ADC can automatically switch through multiple different sampling configurations without CPU intervention. Another feature on the Q71 to reduce overall power consumption is called Peripheral Module Disable. Unused peripherals consume a small amount of parasitic power even when not enabled. By enabling peripheral module disable on unused peripherals, designers can save additional power in their applications. Lastly, the Q71 offers three power saving modes. Doze mode, in which the CPU runs at a reduced instruction clock. Idle mode, in which all other CPU operations are halted while peripherals operate. And sleep mode, in which the CPU is halted and most of the peripherals are stopped, resulting in the least amount of power consumption. Microchip's PIC-18 F56Q71 family of microcontrollers allow users to optimize power consumption in embedded systems using a variety of power saving options. Visit the link in the description below for more information about the device. Also included in the description is a link to MPLAB Discover, which is home to an array of many projects including numerous low power applications. That is all for this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more.